Hey everyone, it's Laura. I'm here with my ice cream beauty box for July. Um, last month for June, I got the bag, which is, you know, the smaller version. Um, I upgraded to the box starting with July. Um, and because I upgraded in the middle of the month, I didn't get to pick. Um, normally you do get a choice item. So starting with August, I will get my choice item. But I'm really happy because I got this actually in this month where the June bag was a little bit delayed and I got it just a couple like a week and a half ago I think um, so they're back on track so that's good so the box is $24 a month and that includes shipping so you just pay whatever your taxes in your state um, and it includes five to seven full-size items there's no um, sample sizes and there's you're guaranteed a pallet in every box so this is my um, third time actually getting this box I got it back in November and December of last year and I didn't get anything until June I got the bag and then I decided I wanted to upgrade to the box because I canceled BoxyCharm so anyway without further ado let's see what we got I did uh, pre-slice it open but it just comes in this little box and it's got like a marble pattern on it so here is the inside and this is a small company they're um, you know like privately owned and ran and they this is what you get for your info card so it doesn't have like the big descriptions like you get with your ipsy or your your boxy charm but honestly it's makeup like i don't need a big long description but it's really cute because it's fourth of july theme look at that the little stars in the in the foams it's so cute and same thing on here and it says july because baby you're a firework Cute. Now I'm gonna have that stupid song stuck in my head. Anyway, um, <laughs> all right, let me just move this foam out of the way. I will save the, maybe I'll do the palette last. Ooh, there's more than one palette in here. Ooh, that's exciting. So I have one, two, three, four, five items, probably because there's two palettes, because you can get up to seven, um, like if they're smaller items. So anyway. Uh, further ado and again forgive my background I know I said this um, in previous videos but our air conditioning is broken so I'm filming in my living room because it's a little bit cooler in here and I do have a fan and a little portable cooling unit going so hopefully the noise isn't too distracting and the lighting isn't too weird and um, I've got a natural glow no highlighter <laughs> okay so first up we have a lip liner um, by Cleo Noir it's a twist up lip liner. MSRP on this is $18 and it is shrink wrapped. Let me just see if I can open this. That's what I like about this. Um, this box is that it's all makeup. It's, I like my makeup. I'm not too into the, I mean, I like skincare cause you know, I got skin and I do have to care for it, <laughs> but it's just to me, skincare is kind of boring. Like makeup is fun. You get to play with it. So, all right. I think I'm getting this open. <laughs> I might have to pause and come back. Right, hold on, guys. Okay, I'm back. So it said Cleo Noir Twist Up Liner, and I just assumed lip liner for some reason. This is the world's darkest lip liner. <laughs> it's an eyeliner. <laughs> it's a black eyeliner. And it's a twist up, which I do like, and it's a gel, um, but I'm not gonna swatch it because I have like a million eyeliners and I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep it. But the MSRP on that is $18. So that's nice. Okay, next up we have a lippy, yay, <laughs> my favorite. Hikari Cosmetics Lip Gloss, MSRP on this is 20, and the shade is Merlot see there and I don't have a lippy on right now so I'm gonna try this right away because I'm looking pasty <laughs> oh that's pretty I do have something else by oh I got a Hikari blush um, from ice cream beauty um, a few months back and it was a little dark this is dark too but I don't mind it in the lippy it's not really a, a shade I would scream summer to me Seems more like a fall shade. 
However, it's very pretty. Sorry about that. Hmm. All right. Well, I like that. Like I said, it's more of a fall color. Um, but yeah, so got that lippy. All right. Then we've got the big ticket item. I'm going in the order on this card. It's a eyeshadow palette. MSRP is $65. It's by either Juice or Juice, depending on who you ask. Freematic Eyeshadow Pro Palette. Awful small for 65 bucks, eh? Okay, looks like they're neutrals. Yep. Okay. <laughs> does look pretty though. I love the packaging. That's cool. That's curved like that. Very heavy. And it has a little button to pop it open. And there is a mirror. So we'll cover that. And it's a 10 pan. And it's got the flavor saver on here, which I'm having problems getting off because it's like thick. It's like, I'll show you guys. You see that? They pop up, I think. That is like the craziest thing. <laughs> I might have to pause again while I figure this out. All right, hold on guys. Okay, I am back. Now, a couple other people already opened theirs, but I didn't watch anyone's videos because I didn't want to be spoiled. So that's why I didn't know how to do this. So if you watch Stephanie the Opinionated Horsewoman or I think Simply Steph gets this too. Like I said, I didn't watch anyone's videos. But each one has got a little plastic cover over it. I took them off of these two. The ones on the end. <laughs> they look like that. These pop out, they're magnetic. And then you slide the little cover off. So like this one, I popped out down here. See that? It's not, not the craziest. I'm assuming because it's like a Z palette because these are magnetized. And then it just goes right back in there. But I would, I guess I'm gonna take all the plastic covers off assuming that I'm gonna keep this. Ain't that the craziest thing? Yeah, and then it just goes back in there. So, about the colors, of course, now I can't get that one to go in. It, the top row is shimmers, and then the bottom row are mattes. You can see I don't have that one in there, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see if I can get that in there. <laughs> Got it, finally. Goodness gracious. Okay. That's why these two aren't sitting in the same position as those because they don't have the little plastic cover on them. And I already stuck my finger in there. So let's go on and swatch it since I already touched them. That's one of the mats. And then I'll do the shimmer right above it. Pretty. So it says, let's see. All right. So, it's got pictures of the colors and what they're called, but they don't match the bottom row on mine. This one is not that clearly. You see that? It's almost like they duplicated these two, maybe? This row looks like it matches, <laughs> but... This is, these are supposed to be the shimmer versions and these are supposed to be the matte, so they're supposed to be the same color, but I have an anomaly here. <laughs> Isn't that the weirdest thing? I'm supposed to have one that's called Jacqueline, which is probably supposed to be like a silver shimmer or a silver matte version of this one, like a light, almost like a cream, like a dove color. Really weird, but obviously I'm gonna keep it because I swatched it already. I love the packaging and I like that you know, it's reusable. You can take the pans out, but I don't know about that one color that seems like it's messed up. 
seems like I'm missing a shade. So I might try contacting ice cream. I don't know if they'll do anything about it, but so yeah. And then each pan had this little, you know, with the company's logo on it, this little cover over it. <laughs> Crazy. Never seen it before. But anyway, so that $65 palette that was. Then I got a blush by Be A Bombshell. MSRP on this is $14. It looks like a really pretty shade. It's called Glowing Goddess. Sorry about the glare. So let's give that an open. I'm gonna swatch this too because frankly, I need some blush. I'm just using a couple of like samples that I got from Ipsy. Um, I'm out of my full size blush, I panned one. Yay, I was excited. So as long as this one's not too dark, I'll keep it. Looks like that should be a good match. It's like a really pretty rose. Give that a little swatch. Oh yeah, that's nice. It looks brighter pink um, in the pan than it does on my hand. Yeah, that'll work. Okay, so we got that. The MSRP on that was 14. I don't know if I said that already. So if I did, apologize. Last but not least, I got a concealer palette from Crown. Um, $26 is the MSRP on this. So um, this I'm not gonna swatch because I'm probably gonna put this in a giveaway. I'm not a big, um, I just use concealer under my eyes and then occasionally on I didn't put any concealer on that. Um, but I definitely, like, that's too much for me to, like, play around with the colors and all that stuff. It's more of a, I don't know, it's like a very professional type of thing. It's even got a little silica gel packet in there. Fancy. So. You know, like you see, like, if you've ever had your, your makeup professionally done, like for my wedding, you know, they'll, they'll come out with one of these and they mix the colors to get it just right. Sorry about the glare. There is obviously a color saver over that. No mirror, but I would think you wouldn't use a mirror for this type of, I mean, you wouldn't use that type of mirror for this type of product. You would want like a like big lighted mirror, I would think. But anyway, so we got that. And that, like I said, the MSRP is $26. So while I had you on pause before, I added up the total and it's $143 for this um, this box. So I'm pretty happy with it. Other than the weird thing with the the one eyeshadow, it just seems like I've got a, a color that's not correct in that palette. So I don't know if I'm, I don't know that it's worth necessarily contacting ice cream about that or not. It is a nice palette. I, do I need a neutral palette? Not really, but I'm gonna keep it. I mean, it's. MSRP on that was $65, which is just bananas to me. So to recap, <laughs> I got this Crown Beauty um, Concealer Palette, 10 colors. I got this Be A Bombshell Blush in, what was that shade? Glowing Goddess. Those are just a really soft pink color. And then I got the Doucet 10 Pan Ten pan? I can count, right? 12 pan palette. <laughs> $65 for that. Crazy. I got a black eyeliner um, by Cleo Noir. And I got a lip gloss, which is back in the box. This Hikari um, lip gloss in Merlot, which I'm currently wearing. So that's what I got for... Um, $24. They do have a deal where you can sign up for three months and you save a little bit. I think it was like $68 or $69. That's what I did. So, um, so, oh, and then it includes free shipping. I just had to pay tax. Sorry, I kicked my green light. I'm a mess, you guys. <laughs> anyway, thanks so much for watching. Um, please like and subscribe and I will see you on my next video. Bye-bye.